Hi guys, this is Gallifrey Customs and welcome back to another video. <laughs> channel so today i'm very excited to share with you the final figure set of the first lot of bnm sets for this year and we have the doctor who history of the dalek set 14 uh the revelation of the daleks from 1985 and it's a very exciting set featuring two necros daleks it's 5.5 inch 14 centimeters scale collector's series and as you can see from the front of the packaging, you've got the TARDIS in the corner, uh, you've got the limited edition sticker, and then it says the Sixth Doctor at the bottom, and it has this lovely yellowy glow that the Sixth Doctor and TARDIS set had. Um, and I kind of talked about it briefly in my last review. Each set is going to be in a different colour based on what Doctor. So each Doctor's got their own individual colour, and it's obvious that Six is yellow. And we don't know the rest yet because the Herndle and Dalek set was kind of categorised as its own thing, as like a special set because technically he's a he's not the first Doctor in a actor's sense, and he wasn't from the first Doctor's era, like when it was when the episode aired. So yeah, um, but yeah, absolutely fantastic packaging. Um, the one thing that does bug me slightly is this here. I think that the figure should be moved over a bit if they're going to have this section here. Um, the only thing is as well, it's slightly fragile, this packaging, and that's why there's a rip up here in the corner, but um, it's not the end of the world. But yeah, so if we look at the side of the packaging, there's not very much to talk about on that. And then there's the back of the box if you would like to pause it and have a read. But without further ado, let's look at the figures inside. So here we have the figures out of the box and I'm not gonna go too much into detail. They're quite simple. They're kind of the same Dalek sculpt pretty much as the standard. Um, but I'll talk about the few little changes that there are. So this is obviously from the story Revelation of the Daleks and it's the two white Necros Daleks. Um, so as I just said, there is some new tooling. So um, I think the ice sculpt is a reuse. It might be new, I'm not 100% sure. Someone will correct me in the comments, I'm sure. Um, but it looks new to me. Um, and the lights are slightly smaller and look new too. Um, and then moving slightly further down, it has that net gap that's now been introduced on the Dalek figures. Um, it was featured on the History of the Daleks 13 set, the one that I've just reviewed, the uh, Five Doctors one, um, where they've added this little lip in here just to raise that neck um, of the Dalek, the neck bin, um, as some people call it. Um, and then other than that, sculpt-wise, the only other thing that I can see that's new is the front midsection. So when it comes back around, you'll be able to see that this oval on there is actually far more raised than they've ever been. And that is a new sculpt that has been introduced to this set, which I think is a really exciting little addition to the set. Something that they didn't really have to do. They didn't do it on the last versions of these. So it's nice that each time they do these Daleks, they're improving it more and more. Uh, Colour wise, um, it's annoying, I don't have the original Necros Dalek with me for this review, but these are a bit more of a cream colour, kind of similar to the Imperial Daleks from um, Remembrance of the Daleks, but probably just ever so slightly less cream and a bit more white. Um, and then the gold is a very bright, shiny gold now, um, compared to the slightly duller gold that we've had previously. Um, so yeah, they're both really, really nice variants, really clean, and um, I really like them. Um, potentially two of my favourite History of the Dalek sets, uh, Daleks that we've had so far. Um, I'm looking forward to the Imperial, because 
I think they're probably going to sculpt the slats more accurate. Um, and I do prefer the Imperial Daleks to the Necros ones. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to that. But for this, I'm just super, super pleased. I think they've turned out absolutely fantastically. Um, and they're a great addition to the collection. They're going to look so aesthetically pleasing on the shelf. Um, and yeah, I hope you all like it too when you find these in your local store. So thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe and comment for more. And um, I will look forward to seeing you all very soon. Thank <laughs> you.